Hey guys, Dr. Brown here for another topic to discuss today, and that is gonna be nipple and areola procedures as standalone surgeries. Now, a totally separate topic is when I do a breast reduction or a breast lift procedure, we're in those cases altering the position of the nipple areolar complex. We're also sometimes reducing the size of the areola, which is something that people want. But what about if you're a patient that isn't looking for a breast lift or needs a breast lift procedure or a reduction, but there's some things about the nipple areolar complex that you don't like. What are a few of those things? One of those things could be that the areola is very big and you don't like that. Another thing could be that the nipple itself is very large or long and you don't like that either. The third most common thing that I would see is a patient who actually has an inverted nipple, which is when it's tethered in by the milk ducts and they want that fixed and everted. So as standalone procedures, all of those can be taken care of. Sometimes those are things that I can do in the office, Sometimes those are things that I'm doing with your other procedures that you might be having, such as a breast reduction or a breast lift. But for us to do those procedures in the office, you need to be able to tolerate just being numbed up with local anesthetic. So when it's simple like an eversion of the nipple or something like shortening the nipple, that can be done in the office. But when we start messing with the areola, sometimes that can be done in the office too. But most of the time I do those in the operating room under a little bit of sedation just because number one, I think it's a more sterile environment. And number two, I think a little bit of sedation is great. So you don't have to have a general anesthesia for one of those procedures. You could simply just be in twilight or sleepy time and we can do the procedures that way. So there are targeted procedures that we can do to address the nipple areolar complex themselves. And if that's something you're interested in, I'd be more than happy to have a consultation with you and talk about it. I hope that helps you guys understand those procedures a little bit better. Thank you so much and have a great day.